this is one of Europe's largest construction sites. The Femmernbelt Tunnel between Denmark and Germany, near the town of Rodbyhavn on the island of Lolland, will be the largest underwater construction in Europe. This means that the new link will be the world's longest immersed tunnel and the fastest route between Scandinavia and Central Europe. The first step in the construction phase is the large-scale work harbor. It has been specially built to take delivery of the huge quantities of sand, cement, steel and gravel that are required to cast this enormous tunnel. Behind the harbor they are building a tunnel factory with six production halls that will continuously cast the tunnel's 89 concrete sections. The tunnel factory will be the world's largest for concrete production. It is expected to provide jobs for thousands of people during construction and manufacturing. The project will also create a number of new jobs in the region, with companies providing raw materials to the site. The finished tunnel will be assembled from 89 pieces that are cast over a skeleton made out of steel and large molds. Once the concrete is set, the molds will then be removed and the tunnel elements will be pushed forwards towards their respective location. The sections that make up the tunnel will be 217 meters long and weigh over 73,000 tons. Two double-lane motorway tubes, two railway tubes and a service passage will be included in its construction. The tunnel sections will be immersed in a 12-meter deep trench on the seabed that is dredged from sea level. In order to clear the seabed for the tunnel, it will take 19 million cubic meters of soil, sand and stone from the seafloor, which then can be transformed into new beaches and land around the tunnel. The construction of tunnel sections will be an around-the-clock operation that takes nine weeks to manufacture one section of the tunnel. It's sealed at both ends with bulkheads and the dry dock is flooded when the cement section is ready for transport. The section is towed out into the deep end of the dock, after which the water level in the section is lowered to sea level. Tugboats will tow the section in position in the femoral belt, and ballast tanks are filled with water. The section is then lowered onto the sea floor. For the tunnel to be watertight, it must have all sections installed with millimeter precision. Once they are in place, the water is pumped out. This creates a partial vacuum and ensures a watertight connection. Finally, once they've closed the tunnel off with stone, the stone will act as a protective layer. You're going to see a quick transformation after that as the current from the water will cover the tunnel with sand. Tunnel buildings are being constructed on Rodbyhavn, Lalland and Putt Garden in Germany to make travel smoother. Once the installation of the tunnel is complete, there will be a smooth transition between land and tunnel. People will then be able to cross the Femmernbelt in 7 minutes by train and 10 minutes by car. The world's largest immersed tunnel is estimated to be ready in 2029. Cost of this project is estimated between 7.3 billion euro and 10 billion euro. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe.